and welcome back ladies and gentlemen to another Bobby's backyard this is our 1998 forest river red rock or rocks red rock rock wood <laughs> rock wood freedom freedom edition uh, I think it's a 14 foot long 17 foot fully extended with uh, both sides out and what I did yesterday I didn't film it was that I changed everything outside that was uh, non LED to LED so I changed the porch light to LED this one uh, the old one didn't have a lens and it didn't even work and there was power to it so there was something bad on that so I changed that and then all the corner lights changed all those to LED changed the tail lights to LED there's the old ones right there still got to change three more change this one this was a game changer right here because they had the license plate here with no light this one bam has a light when the parking lights turn on illuminates the license plate perfect so yep changed them all uh check the heater heater works perfect check the refrigerator refrigerator works perfect uh the faucet and everything worked perfect had a little leak fix that uh, more leds all the front led propane tanks full i'm going to take another propane tank with us things pretty nice so i'm going to change these three right now and then when we get to the campsite i'll give you a walkthrough through the whole thing on inside and what it does this even has a little extension for the stove from inside you can cook outside or inside gas line comes out from here or from the uh, countertop awesome all right until then catch you back later all right got the last three out install the last three in and that'll finish all the lighting not all soldered and heat shrinked all right I'll just screw them in and then um, I already cleaned all the surfaces on all the other lights I just got to clean the surface on these three lights and then I'm gonna use the uh, let's see over here yeah, the gorilla caulk and seal waterproof so I should work out perfect all right all right all sealed up looks good All of them all sealed up. Nice, man. Heck yeah. Have a practically brand new trailer. Up updated anyways. There's that one. Jack Jack, come on, man. He's hungry. It's feeding time. So, yep, all of them sealed. The only one I had trouble with was this one. The wood inside is a little rotted. There is a little bit of rot this one but it's not bad it's very minor but as now that it's sealed it should be all right heck yeah all right guys before it gets too dark i want to show you what the leds look like i think on a last clip or one of the clips i said i was going to show you at night well <laughs> finally got to it i've uh, been busy lately but this is what it looks like right now with the lights off let me put the parking lights on be right back and bam and that's what it looks like pretty cool it is bright way better than the other ones those halogens check it out lights up the license plate very nicely hell yeah these are cool came out good man there's that one and there's these and let me do the turn signals be right back and that's what the back looks like I have it hooked up to the blazer it works better with the uh, ML 
All right, and this is with the out, the lights on. Pretty cool. So, yep, update it little by little. On the inside, I'm probably going to do some upgrades also, do some flooring, redo the flooring. All right, so on the next video, like, like I said, we'll do a walkthrough. All right, I finally got it all set up and everything. I actually just got back from camping. Like I told you, I was going to film us going camping, but it was dark when we got there. And the next day it was cloudy and rainy. And then the next day it was just real rain. And now, now it's, as you can see, sun's out now. So I set it up out here so it can dry out. So I can't put it away wet or else you'll get mold. So I'm letting it air out dry but this is basically what it looks like all set up now and what you do is you slide these out after you unhook all four of these all four of those you raise it up with this handle clockwise until it raises all the way up and then you put these support bars on all four corners front and back for the beds you got your propane right there come around this way Got your other sleeping quarters here here are the other supports and then these are the leveling jacks right there there and there all four corners put those out it's got the small door right now half door you can either have half door the other part of the door is up there and uh, hinge it down there you bring it down it hooks up right here slides in through there slides in through there as you walk in you got the fridge heater which works awesome then you got your sleeping quarters right here if you have extra people it turns into a table right here's the table here's one of the sleeping quarters all three can uh, unzip then you have window and air right here you have tent and you can open them uh -huh, that's why it was hard to go. Big dog, you gotta watch out. I forgot about this guy. All right, put him. We got storage down here. Uh, more storage there. Utensils and stuff like that. All like that. The stove is down there. It attaches right there. The gas line comes through there, and this little attachment right here lets you bring the stove out here hang it you put the uh, gas through here comes out connect it boom you got 110 out here like I said I put a new porch light LED changed all the lights to LED all of them so yeah this is a cool little camper man got your little sink right here I gotta get a new um, new pump it doesn't pump anymore Oh, actually it does. Oh, it works. Wow. Okay. I'm going to... The reason why I don't have it hooked up is the line that comes from the five-gallon tank to the sink is gross. It's got mold in it. So I got to change it. Uh, the tank looks like it's brand new. Everything. And then, oh, also you got a little... Uh, kind of... Not really a skylight, but vent... And again, this fell down. I'm going to attach it again. But that comes down. Like I said, you got fridge. You got storage down here. And you got access from the front also. You got my fire extinguisher in there. This thing's cool. So this is the little tour of my 1998 Rockwood from Forest River. Hope you enjoyed this video. This camper is cool, man this thing is cool please like share and consider subscribing if you haven't subscribed yet thank you for the support if you have talk to you guys later